2023 it's time to leave toxic men alone it's time to leave the narcissist alone if your marriage or relationship is not working it's time to take a step back get out of the toxic marriage okay save yourself save your kids from the toxic marriage hey guys so guys today i'm gonna be doing something different on this channel because I want to talk about this Derek Jackson situation. You know what? I was not going to talk about it, but I was like, you know what? I think I just need to give my two cents, my own opinion about the situation right here. So, I was calling on Instagram on the shady room. I see that Derek Jackson announces the first of his wife. I was like, anyway, I already see that coming. But... The way he announces the divorce after he was exposed again of cheating, he was in Miami with another woman. Then he came on Instagram to deal with damage control because I just see that as a damage control. Oh, me and my wife will get in a divorce, we are divorced, okay? I don't want to come here and talk about David Jackson because this man has built his platform talking down on men, telling women what they need to look for in a man. That men are in shit. We all know that some men are in shit. We already know that, okay? But not all men are like that, okay? The way he was talking down on, on men did not seem right to me, okay? I was like, there's something about this guy. So when the cheating allegations came out, I was like, anyway, I knew he was cheating, okay? He's always He was always doing videos in his cars and stuff like that. And I think that he and his wife has been together since like high school and stuff like that. Let me tell you something about his wife. His wife like is a Christian woman like she believe in god and sometimes men like derry jackson they always go for the christian woman the homebody someone that will be there to raise their kids to raise their children okay and then they will be out there messing with other females so i'm happy for the wife and his wife went on instagram like few weeks back like cussing people that are talking down on her marriage that marriage has been dead i'm telling you that marriage has been dead one thing i want to talk about we women we need to do better we need to do better okay if your marriage or relationship is not working it's okay for you to take a step back okay a marriage or relationship is not a do or die affair let me talk about marriage marriage is not a do or die affair if your marriage is not working it's okay for you to take a step back okay you can be separated i have seen people getting separated and then they come back together that's okay but marriage is not a do or die of fear, okay? Most women they don't want to get divorced because they said, "Oh, I'm going." What people are going to say about me, or what the society is going to think about me? You need. You can see a woman that is broken, okay? When I saw that that woman came on Instagram, was raising curses on people that were talking about her marriage you can see a broken woman right there she is broken i'm telling you she has been hurt she has been betrayed she has been abused okay so i was like so when this divorce came out Derek jackson i think he was the one that filed for the divorce because i knew that a woman would not file for divorce one thing about christian women we all believe that i'm a christian myself i believe in god we all believe that okay um divorce is not an it's not an alternative but guess what if a man cheated me count first of all i'm not gonna allow you to cheat on me countless times we're not going to do, going to do that okay if a man cheated me i am out of the door i am out okay i am out because once a cheater is always a cheater okay one thing that we women need to do is that we need to realize the signs the red flags okay most of the time they have been together for a very long time since high school most of the time we knew those men are in shit but we end up to get married to them okay if a man cheated on you in a relationship he is gonna still cheat on you when you 
you get married to him he's going to continue to cheat okay he's going to continue to cheat and one thing about cheating when you once you cheat on someone is going to take the relationship to another level that you are not going to want to deal with because one thing about cheating then now you have to gain the trust okay and most of the time some men don't want to do the work to gain the trust okay I don't think that Daryl Jackson ever loved that woman okay I never think that okay he never loved that woman they have been together from high school that's why for me I don't think I would have married my high school sweetheart because I believe that sometimes a lot of people go out of love okay you go out of love and it's okay to move on it's okay for you to move on 2023 what we are not going to do it to be doing get out of every toxic marriage toxic relationship okay leave these men alone okay men that i should leave them alone okay leave them alone okay it, it's okay for you to be divorced it's okay for you to be separated okay we are not doing that 2023 it's time for we women to do better it's time for we to do better you want to you want don't want to raise your kids in a broken home okay you want, don't want to do that okay you don't want to do that because most of the time i hear some women say oh i can't leave him because of my kids well guess what you are doing so much harm to you so guys, this is my two cents on the Derek Jackson situation, okay? I was not going to talk about this, but I was like, you know what? We women need to do better, okay? It's time for us to leave toxic men alone, okay? It's time for us to leave the narcissists alone. Leave them alone. 2023, we are not doing this, okay? We are not doing this, okay? I just feel sorry for her because all the curses that she was waiting on, people that were talking about her marriage, it's crazy and she really do need help she really do need help okay i just pray for her that she find the peace and it's time for her to move on i'm telling you okay this guy has embarrassed her so much on social media and the only time we came to know the wife is for cheating for cheating and then he wants to do a damage control so guys that's all i have to say we need to do better we need to do better we need to leave this toxic man alone that's all this is my message i'm passing out there okay it's okay to take a step back take a step back take a step back if your relationship is not working your marriage is not working marriage is not a do or die of you okay take a step back so love you guys make sure you like comment and subscribe to this channel if you haven't subscribed love you guys and